Now, Wednesday, the 6th of July 2022, marked 100 days since passengers were abducted in the Abuja Kaduna train attack. Families, relatives, and friends of the remaining 50 abducted train passengers held a peaceful street protest in Kaduna to demand the immediate release of the victims. The protesters stormed the uh, Nagwamatsi house located along the busy Ali Aikilu Road, Kaduna, holding placards with different inscriptions calling for the immediate release of the remaining abducted train passengers. In an interview with different family members, they call on the government to do, the, to do more in facilitating the release of those abducted. Loved ones can be back to us. There are little children who are in school. They are out of school for 100 days. Imagine, little kids that don't know anything. Innocent souls. Innocent souls that we can even look at the world through their eyes. But how can those children now grow up and tell the story of their nation? The government have failed us woefully. That's all I can see because there's no way their citizen their citizens can be in captivity for 100 days and without them doing anything like that's really bad of them i don't think i can ever vote anyone in this country again i have my pvc but i have broken it because i don't know what to go and who to go and vote for because they are all the same 